Hi, my name is Dallas Gresham, and this is my submission to Enable for my Kinetic Hand from Free 3D Hands. Uh, this was printed at 70% scale. The print quality came out pretty nice, although there are a few blobs and zits on the fingers from printing all of those pieces on the same build plate that'll have to be fixed in the future with uh, retraction and cooling settings. And there's a few not too bad little dipsy doodles on the un overhangs on the finger joints. Again, that's going to be either extrusion temperature or the cooling fan. Uh, the TPU took a little while to get the settings for printing the palm mesh uh, in good quality. That's just flexible filaments. Even if you get the best settings in the world, you're going to run into a part that still doesn't print right. Um, construction, the uh, PLA components, that's ESUN PLA Plus, so stronger than regular PLA. The TPU components are Ninja Tech Cheetah, which isn't quite as soft as the recommended Ninja Flex. It's a little easier to print, but it still has considerable stretch to it. The tendons are 80 pound braided fishing line and I've got my Velcro straps. The finger grips are silicone molded from Smooth-On's Dragon Skin 30A Hardness uh, Skin Safe Molding Silicone. I have also printed out a full set of the palm spacers to accommodate uh, palms that might not fit all the way up into the device. Uh, function wise, I followed the assembly instructions and the hand is open when the palm is parallel to the gauntlet and there is a very narrow angle to flex the hand. Uh, little function test, grabs this bottle of hand sanitizer pretty well and the thumb does close on the inside of the index finger. Uh, things I learned while doing this. I wish there was more adjustability, infinite adjustability, in the finger tension. It's very hard to balance the tension of the tendons just by where you tie the knots and having a finite number of little holes where you can uh, anchor the tendons. Uh, so that was very difficult to get the fingers tensioned properly so that things close in the right order. Uh, all in all, it was not a terrible build. Um, <coughs> the printing, uh, the PLA components, that wasn't bad. TPU took a little playing with to get the settings right. Like I said, that's just flexible filaments. Uh, they can always be finicky like that. Um, all right. Thank you. Once again, my name is Dallas Gresham, and this is my submission for my kinetic hand from Free 3D Hands to enable for the fabricator and assembly badges. Thank you.